Hey everybody, I'm Blitz. Cycle 40 is upon us in our fifth video. <laughs> Someone has diarrhea. <laughs> I don't know why that's funny. Uh, it just is. Okay, welcome back. Uh, having fun playing this colony. So today, I forgot what we're gonna do. Um, we have our food stockpiles finally going. We can make sure that's off. I totally just dumbed out and forgot what we were gonna do. Uh, yep. Well, welcome back. <laughs> we'll figure it out here in a little bit. I'm trying to record these up the best I can uh, with the time that I have. So if it is a little bit spotchy and, and everything, it's just been a little bit tough. Went to new baby around, but I wanted to do it. Uh, it's a challenge that I wanted to take. So uh, we're going we're gonna to go with that challenge. I probably could have just watched the last 15 seconds or 20 seconds of my last video. I didn't think to do that. So let's just wing it. That's what we're going to do today. Low quality YouTuber, that's me. Um, I did think about getting this pumped over there, but I don't really want to get this pipe too big. I don't want to get this tube too full, because uh, I want it to kind of be under that layer. Uh, we do have that one bottle emptier that I have set for liquids. We have this one set for bad liquids. This one's the nasty one, and then this one's the good one here. All right? yep, liquid, good water, niner on both of those. Cool, everyone is picking up the rest of the sandstone from what we've already done. And I think, you know, what we should do is maybe make a, a nice little massage area. That could be fun. Uh, let's start with that. We'll make a massage area for our people. We'll make a new hospital area. And we're going to do the same mesh tile over here. And we'll come across this way. All the way across to here. Ah, I keep right-clicking to clear it. Did, that that might have changed or something. I don't know. I feel like I used to right click all the time, and not just going back and forth. Someone's entombed. Who's this? Why do you have to be so dumb? Oh boy. Oh boy. Uh oh. No. No, no, no. Aha! <laughs> I saved your bacon! How's that feel? Pretty, probably pretty good. I can't imagine being entombed would be a, a good feeling, so getting unentombed would probably be even a really good feeling. There we go. So we'll make up a nice little area here. We'll put in regular doors like these pneumatic, panam, ten, panam, pneumatic doors. I think probably getting an oxygen facility working too. That's decent. So we have good oxygen, but how much LG, LJ? Not too much. Whoops, wrong button. Uh, so let's just rip it apart. Hey, baby. Yeah, don't jump down there. It's not a good idea to do that. Okay, do that. And then we'll do this one too. Okay, everyone's gonna rip this thing apart. That's awesome. <laughs> I love the narcoleptic one. All right, everything's working great. Let's move this one up here. We'll do a couple squeaky squeakies up there. Perfect. Okay, so this is gonna be our med bed area. Oh, uh, I went to bed tonight. And I did manage to get in three paintings on both sides of the nighttime. We're gonna clear those out. Everything's fine, I think. I want those little light bugs to come down because I like the little mood boost they give, which is kind of cool. So yes, I think that's gonna work. Do we want to get another person in here? Let's see if there's a good one. Uh, immunity, strength, learning, meh, nah, reject him. Rejected! We did it. See how I did that? I did it in, in, in I was gonna say em, emphatically? I don't think that's the right word. Uh, enthusiastically, there's the right word. Get rid of this trash. We don't need that in your base. Just slowing people down, doing the work. There we go, do the deliveries. Delivery system. I do like this thing. We could go into here. It needs power. <laughs> I really have no idea what that's for. Um, okay, is everyone still working? Yes, it is. Insufficient unrefrigerated food. Yeah, I'm aware of that. Totally aware of that. I think we might have too much food now, which is not a problem. We want to get to that kind of equilibrium. Ooh, there's a big word. So let's do this. We're going to dig this out right here. And we're going to need power, too. Ooh, power. Pow, pow, power rangers. I'm going to make a the system that I usually do with, uh, or somewhat similar, I think, with the oxygen and the electrolyzers. I don't have them, so let's research them. Research button's up here. Electro, electrolyzing, electro error apocalypse. Where is this? Electrolyzer, right there. <laughs> Took me a while to find it. Okay, they'll knock that out pretty quickly. And once we have that, we can move on. Um, hey, picked up the meal ice up top. Cool. So if you guys would go ahead and do that, that'd be awesome. Let's put in three more of those little furniture beds just to make it look similar. 
put in three of there. We do have this beautiful little setup here. I don't think I have anything under medicine else that we need. I love that painting sound. Sink apothecary. Um, so we could do that. I don't know. How big is that one? I don't know. I don't know how big that is. We'll just let it ride for a little bit. Hey, wait. I'm only supposed to have one person painting. You're fired. You're fired, Night Huntress. Gun jammed is my painter extraordinaire. I like that screen painting. That's awesome. Okay. Let's go back in. We're going to need to reroute our power system pretty soon. I think this only works when someone's laying in it. So we aren't too concerned about that. Yay, another masterpiece. We got that sand rolling in here. Cool. And I do like not having uh, this slimy area up in here. I want to go into this. See what it does. Unassigned. Assign it and gate. I really don't know how to use these. I'm not good at circuits stuff. I'm not at all. I'd have to look at it. I could understand it. That's a jump. These aren't plugged in. I have no idea what's going on there. No clue at all. Okay, so if I get the electrolyzers done, we're going to need more power. Um, and we probably don't need too much. Ooh, bedtime. So I've been putting in a few of these uh, airflow tiles. I want good airflow through the base. Uh, that one's messed up. Okay, we can move that. We can change it. We have the technology. I've been putting them up here, too. Kind of like that idea. I really want this base to have good airflow. Uh, I can't do that one. Uh, ooh, that was a good sound. That's my research being complete, I bet, without even looking at it. It is. Cool. So we got the electrolyzers going on. Uh, more power is going to be very important sometimes, too. We're going to need this automation control. Generic. Genetic? Generic. Generic sensors. That's a clock and weight. Huh. So that must be that thing over on the other side. There's an advanced automation power situation. Plastic manufacturer. We're going to need this really soon. I don't know if I want to do it brute force. Let's just start working on some of these things. Healthcare. Let's get the healthcare up. We'll get the apothecary and then the other things, a hand sanitation station. I like that. Okay. And we're going to waste up a bunch of materials worth this. I think we do have too much food now. <laughs> That's, well, you know what? We can always get a couple more people in, and then we wouldn't necessarily have to have problems with food anymore. Right? If we did that, we can get more people in. Um, it's kind of that that hit or miss thing. Do you want more people or do you not want more people? More people always helps out with work, but it also eats up the resources oxygen faster. So it's kind of one of those where do you want more or not want more? I'm going to open that up since we got a little dingus stuck in there. Open everything up. Open all the things. Good. That looks awesome. Now he can walk around nicely. Whatever. We're going to open that one up too so this little guy can be free as the wind blows. I do want to get some traps rolling in and those guys can eventually help us out. But we're going to have to dig down to the bottom of the planet so we can get some uh, get some petroleum. What is that? It's another one of those rooms. Might actually be able to dig down right there. Huh. Could maybe start that. I want to find the petroleum before we can really... Well, we have to use the plastics, so I'd rather get my oxygen system set up first and then we can get the, uh, the other stuff working. Okay. Ooh, perfect timing for a bed. Looks like they got it all done. I decided to lock this thing just so they can't get in to work on those. We have 20,000 and this stuff's already ready, so we're good on food for a little bit. This thing is almost empty, so we're going to have to reroute. That's what I was going to do. I was going to reroute the, the plumbing system. Okay, we can do that. I do know how to reroute plumbing. I've done plumbing in real life. It's not fun. Actually, the two things that I dislike the most about construction is concrete work and plumbing. Um, I That's just the things I don't like. Shingling? I did shingling. I did seven summers of shingling growing up. That's fine with me. I'll shingle every day. But just put me down in a hole in a basement? No, thank you. Not trying to not trying to get the concrete put in. Or plumbing trying to fit in the bad little corners trying to get a toilet in. I hate it. I hate them. <sighs> but I digress. So let's let's get this stuff working out. We're going to remove these. We're going to remove this. Probably going to cause a little bit of a stink in our base. And we're going to put up our new plumbing line. The bathroom is going to stop for a little bit. Uh, plumbing line is going to come from here. And it's going to come up here and over to this. Okay. And we're going to remove this area here. I think that'll work. We'll have to remove that one. Okay, so that one's being removed. We are losing water around the base, so it is time. Oh, we got germs too, I bet. 
Okay, let's mop it all. Mop it up, mop it up. Mop it all up. Mop everything up. That's my new song. Do you like it? <laughs> I did. I feel like such a dork when I sing. So I know I have the I have the uh, singing capabilities of like a goldfish. That's about my singing levels right there. Okay, everyone's good here. Good. Now you you dump the the dump the stink water off in the stink hole. Good job. Good work. Good work, stinkers. You done you done did the good one. Cool. What are they doing? <laughs> oh, that thing's out of juice. Actually, is it out of juice or is it out of pipe? It still should work. This thing's not plugged in. Probably need to plug that in. Does that say it is no pump? Okay, cool. We can mop it up then. Mop it up, mop it up. We can't actually get down to it. So this deconstruct, deconstruct. It's my goldfish sounds. Okay, and then down. Let's do a ladder down now. Zoot boy! You're down, you go. Good job, fella. Okay, got some nice digging happening over here. How is this looking? Resource eaten. That's okay. Uh, so this is gonna come in now and you kind of have to have a loop all right so that comes up and then this comes up and over so the water flows over so these come out this flows up this goes over um, and we have to do a little bit of this right and then we'll come up here and over so all of these will be removed I think if my brain works right today, that's what we need. And it should have dropped some stink water down. Oh, not too much. Okay. Whew. Rerouting power. Rerouting toilets. You guys can hurry up and do that, you know, right? Please? There you go. Get that research done. Nice bathroom. It's not really plugged in, though, fella. <laughs> Food poisoning. Okay, we got to we gotta de germ this place, too. We're going to build it all. I hope this will work. So this thing is empty here. We could remove all the piping on this side just to keep the base clean. Take this out like that. And now we need to get the plumbing or the wiring in here. Wait, I don't want I want this tab. Wiring tab. Where, where's the wire tab? Oh, it's too off. Got it. This is really great. Really great. We got polluted water down here in our good water tank somehow. I have no idea how that got in there. But I can't just go down. I don't think I can anyway. Is anyone going to go down that deep into water? No, unreachable. They'd have to wear a special suit to go in there to do it. I don't think I have those suits researched yet. Oh, well. Uh, let's see what else we can do. So we're getting a dig out for the great... Uh, ooh, fleeing. Hee, <laughs> they got one. Forgiveness. <laughs> I love it when you get you unlock the hatches. And they're like, oh, I hate everything. They're like, oh, never mind. I forgive you because I love you now. So, yes, it is looking like it's working. Bad water is flushing through. Good water is coming in. It's pumping up. This is entirely stupid. Let's kill those right away so we're not pumping in circles. Not wasting power. And it looks great. All right. That is picked up there. We got that happening. Um, I do want another area that we can dig. Let's grab that. Or not dig. Um... Let's just finish this area out here. Like it's meant to be made. Build those. Ah! Don't right click. Up. Oh, that's not right. Just kidding. <laughs> we'll do it the right way this time. Down here. There you go. Click. Click, click, click. And click, click. And airflow to click. Dig. Perfect. Right. Let's do another one down here, too. Get these tiles in place. Get the airflow tile in place. Dig all of that junk out. All of those out. All of these out. I guess they'll dig those out automatic. Auto magically. Auto magically delicious. Okay, go for some lucky charms. And that's like pure carbon dioxide. So um, we want a spot at the bottom of this base that collects all the carbon dioxide. In a little cistern. I love that word, cistern. And now, where is the doorway at? Let's just put in magical doors. Oh, that one's in the way. Put one there, one there. And we'll put a couple of these in, right like so. Actually, cancel that one. We'll put an airflow tile at the top there. One there, one there. Ah, come back here. And a tile right there. Put a few more storage capacitors right here. That looks good. 
He'll build those. We will copy these. We will copy these and put them in. So that's awesome. Um, looks great. Okay. I guess we could do the same on this bottom one, but not entirely. All right. So now I need to think. We need to come across here so our guys can dig in here. That's what we need to do. Um, sure. Wonder if they can get that out. Oh, we can put in a base right here. Ah, I don't want that, but we'll tear it out. We just need to dig that out. We also need to build around the outside here. I don't know how far I'm building this in. That's kind of the problem I'm facing. I don't know how big this needs to be, but we'll try it like this. I don't want to go too far into here because of this base. I seem to be flying today. I feel like we're going really, really fast in this video. Ooh, some people are getting germed. Why is that? Why are we getting germy? Disinfect. Let's do a disinfection quick. Oh, just a few things. Weird. Had to have probably been that uh, bad water from the piping that we made. Okay, I like it. Ooh, a new person. Did we get a person today? Yeah, six immunity, two learning, pacifist. I don't care about that, interior decorating divers lungs. Let's take you, Bert. And we're gonna name you Pottles. Hello, Pottles. Welcome back to another colony. Are you currently in RimWorld 2? I'm not sure. My notes kind of got messed up at the beginning of the month uh, with Patreon. The Patreon's got a really, honestly, it's kind of a bad system. Everything about it's kind of, it works, but it's just not great, uh, which is sad, in my opinion. Hey, why don't we have, oh, everyone's disinfecting. That must be a super high priority. All right, come over here, come over here. Good, sandstone, like a sandstone cowboy. That doesn't make sense, it's rhinestone cowboy. And if we did this, then we could work up. I figured it'd be kind of cool to go in here, but there's a little bit of chlorine. It's not that heavy of chlorine, but there's still some. Make a little air gap there. So our little lightning bugs can't go over there. make it four tall like the rest of our base and shoop, shoop, and that should work right why not no work just don't want a bunch of chlorine getting in here I really don't know what this thing does so I want to go play with it there's no power in there so you have to make this checkpoint I guess you could probably deconstruct it I have a feeling you have to plug some of these things in automation wire uh, to get it to work. We'll get to it eventually. <laughs> I really don't know what to do. I also wanted to dig over a little more to see if we're going to lock a geyser of some sort. Kind of hear one. Ah. Hmm. All right. Well, they finished that off. Kind of. Let's finish that. So I'm going to have them. Oh, <laughs> there was a there was one little dude in there. Cool. Uh, I'm going to have them start digging down. Now, this might be a bad idea. Can I mop this first? Mop that up. Too much liquid. Okay. Whatever. I'm just going to have them dig down. I want to know what's down here. Um, there's no germs in this zone, right? Yep. That's only in the, the stink zone. So they're going to dig down over time. And as they're digging down, we're going to start building up our own oxygen level. And we're going to have the electrolyzers. I like the idea of having like four electrolyzers. And that doesn't fit. I guess that fits good enough. Should have made it one more wide, I guess. Four... I could do a couple floors of them, too. Actually, that's what I'll do. Um, and we'll put in our tile right there. Oops, wrong button. And then this one right here. I always do that, don't I? Okay, we we don't have to run all of these at the same time. Uh, but we'll just run a couple right now. And I want to keep pumping things. Okay, so the idea is to remove this. And if I did want another layer, I would do a ladder up here. And I'll do airflow tiles across here. So that way we can run in, we can climb the ladder, we can come over here. We can work on our second floor. We aren't going to need that for a long time. Um, so I'm just going to not do anything with it. Just let it happen. Um, and it's going to take, these take a lot of power. They take a lot of power. How much is it? Details, I forget. It's probably down in this one better. Uh, that's not power, it's oxygen. Oxygen, this one. 
So water, 120 watts. Oh, it's not that much. But the, the whole other system is kind of a lot. So uh, I'm going to build this up so nobody can actually go in there. We should capture him. We will eventually, maybe. And we'll bring you all the way to the top. Okay, so the next thing we need to do is the air ventilation system in here. So these things are kind of nasty. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Refined metal. We have to do some refinery on those. Um, we have the gas pumps, right? And at the top is where the hydrogen will go. So if I did something... Hmm, if I did, like, two pumps in here... Uh, that would work. And we'll do another airflow tile right here. Just let all that airflow in. And then these things are going to be used nicely to get rid of the oxygen. Or the, not the oxygen, the other stuff. Oxygen and hydrogen. So these will pump out. We want both of these to pump out into uh, a separation system. Um, let's see, where is it? Gas valve. There's the filter. We need the filter. Filter. Healthcare. I don't care about that right now. Where's my filter at? Uh, it's probably in the filtration button. Okay. Alright. So this has kind of died out. We actually are looking equilibrium on there, too. I'm fine with that. So this layer is going to be used for more electrolyzers when and if we need them. We need to get that gas, gas filter. I need the gas filter out. A rain is hurting on my face. Can't talk, talk. Can't talk the right language today. Picking up the dirt, hauling the dirt down. Dirty McGurdy. That's looking great. Okay, that's not really what I want. I want you guys to research. Why are you not researching? You already finished that up? Insufficient water. We don't have a water collector guy. So let's make one. Plumbing. And this thing. Okay. Delete, delete. And now plumbing and bottle pump. So if you guys make that, that'll be cool. And then we can get the pump. Then we can continue our research. Hey, it's working. Did he just grab the thing and go to the bathroom? <laughs> I think he did. <laughs> I think he just grabbed it and went to the bathroom. Oh well, that's fine. That's what he wanted. Hey, another bedtime. So guys, check it out. We've been building the ladder down and we already found a steam geyser down here. Now it's super hot. We don't really want to use it without cooling it down. So we might make another room that we can cool uh, using Wee's wart. We're going to have to get to that pretty soon. I would like to maybe make that over here. Uh, we could have a nice little room there that we could cool it down before we send it in. I'm also wondering if we freeze. Nope, freezing polluted water just makes polluted ice, which doesn't work right. Um, so that's not going to work. How's our how's the research coming along? Almost done. I'll have that done in a little bit. I don't remember what the filters do, so uh, we can start running the plumbing lines over there. Plumbing lines. We need clean water. Um, okay. How do I how do I do this then? Uh, we'll do a, a jump. Where's the pump gate? Okay, in, out, out, in, over. And then we'll do another one right here. And then we'll bring that up and over. Okay. That's really ugly. Oh, it's going to be ugly anyway. Stop it. Go up. Over. Jump it. And then come up. Over. Down. And bling! We'll do one in there. And we'll disable these other ones because we don't need them right now. Once they get built, we'll just hit the disable button. We don't really need any. Actually, we're getting very close to being out of LG. So, probably is a good idea we're doing this today. That means the research is complete, too. Okay, and one in. So, if they build that, then we're actually going to have it working. Twink! Twink! Where are you going? What are you doing? Ah, got a pepper nut. Hey. Okay, let's lock this because we don't need people in there. Okay. Oh, we got one working. Finally. Fantastic. Ventilation. We have our filter now. Can I turn this vertically? Ooh. I like that. Hey. I don't like that. Um, hmm. In. So we put both in. Let's just go down here. Uh, I kind of want it right up here. Can I do that? Would that be against the rules? To bring that up one? 
Yeah, whatever. We'll do it right here. No, that's not gonna work. Cancel. Go away. Die. Cancel build. Uh, ventilation. Gas filter right here. That's still not gonna work right. I'm having. I'm trying to think if I would put these both together. We don't want to overwhelm pipes, because if you put too many pipes into things, it gets confused on how things get into it. Um, trying to think the best way. Because we don't want two innies to go into one one port. Because then it doesn't work right. So let's try actually building the piping first. Up, over, in. Okay, that's going to be the innie port right here. So let's build the filter uh, up here with the innie in it. Then we're going to filter out the hydrogen, which will come this way. And that will come up or down. And the oxygen is going to go out to the base. So oxygen goes out to the world. Hydrogen is going to come up. Or is it going to come down? Let's do this backwards. Okay, so that's going to be better. <laughs> it looks really wiggly. I don't really care, though. Uh, all of the air is going to flow in. Uh, and it's going to meet in there. It'll get met in this thing. And the hydrogen will float out that way. The oxygen will float out to the base. Probably. Just need to get power up there too. This is really gonna strain our power system. Pipes are, or pumps are working. That's good news. And we're gonna do another little room right down here as soon as they can dig that out. And this is gonna be for our hydrogen uh, power production. It won't really add that much to our system, but it'll be okay. Hey, they're fleeing again. Okay, oh, gotta go to the bathroom. And it's nap time. Congratulations us. Gotta go to the bathroom and nap. I get all this stinky, nasty air coming into this thing. I'd like to... I don't, I've never really filtered one of those. There are the puffed things that float around and work. But I've never really used them. Uh, I don't, I've don't. never been able to, I think. So I'd also like to be able to pump out all of the hydrogen out of there and use that as our, in our base. Um, this is going to be the hydrogen power. Do I have that? I do. Okay. So this is going to just provide a little bit of extra, and it would be good to run that system. We'll try right here. That'll be cool. And we'll run power from there up into here. Maybe. Uh, I don't know if it's going to be self-sustainable. We'll try it. I just don't want people to go in there once, we, once we're able to use it. So we are going to run this down, and this will come into here. That's going to be our hydrogen level. So we will filter out hydrogen. The rest is going to be oxygen going to the base. And I'll just pop that in right here to begin with. Gas vent, cool, that'll work. And this thing doesn't have any, any Audi, if I remember right. Let's put that up there. Okay. And that should just put in just a little bit at a time. Uh, it's not gonna be a lot of power, but it'll help out a little bit. Cool, bottles worked. Let's make sure all of our gas is being pumped and now it should actually go. Bloop, bloop, little bit of little bit of power. Batteries are filling up. Hopefully we don't have Oh yeah, we are we're getting it. Okay, we're gonna get all of this taken care of right here. I'm gonna build over all of our tiles. So our people are bored. Come down. Wiggle wiggly lines McGee over here. Base tiles going across. And across we have the narcoleptic falling asleep. Looks good. Wow, it's actually quite a bit of hydrogen. <laughs> oh, is it enough? It might be. That thing is overpressurized too. So let's make, um, let's go a little bit further. I should have made this out of, which one heats up? I don't remember. Let's put that right here. We'll do another one right over here. Gas fence, gas fence. Delivering sandstone. And if those are too pressurized. Let's go down a couple layers and we'll do the same thing. Uh, let's go down another layer and we'll do one right here. And we'll come across and we'll do one right in the center. Roughly the center and we'll do one right here. So that should never back up all the way. And we'll just let it work. Okay, that should be cool. We need to dig this one out. And it's nap time. 
I'm actually surprised how well this thing is working already without much in it. I might have to put in an additional pump uh, if we do get all four of these going. I don't think it's going to be an issue, though. It's not backing up, really, is it? Something's happening with it. I'm not sure what it is. <laughs> oh, well. Uh, we're starting to get good oxygen flow. We have a lot of oxygen already. We can remove these. Wow, that was perfect timing, too, because we ran out of... Uh, we just entirely ran out of algae. That's fantastic. What kind of timing? I feel like I almost planned that, but I didn't. There's no way I planned that. Insufficient oxygen generation. We'll be okay. We'll watch here. And we do need to get rid of the carbon dioxide eventually, too. Uh, I wanted to freeze the carbon dioxide and make uh, solid ice out of it. I think that'd be cool. Having a, a chilling room or a frozen room. Now everyone's idle again. Wow. Okay. Um, man. I'm out of ideas. Let's go down deeper. Let's dig deeper and start getting... Uh, we could also try to get the... Ooh, I don't want to bust into this stuff. If I did... I don't want to bust into that bad air. Let's dig over and see if we can find any wee sports in here. Without busting into that bad cavern either. And I know this stuff is really difficult. Okay. Oh, nice. Is it hot down there? It is. Let's mop this up. Mop it up. Mop it up. I just want to collect it all. Get that hot water up collected. Ah, there's a wee sport down. Three of them down there. There's about 30 per mat. Or what I've heard. So it's kind of cool. We're going to bring this ladder straight down. We're going to grab all three of these. Straight down, I said. Oh, wow. We got four of them already. Cool. So we can make a, a decent cooling room. Of some sort. If they can make it through that Epsilite. Which is very difficult to make it through. Get that water in. This bothers me. A little poo water stuck in there. Okay. Um... Man, that hydrogen thing's going good. <laughs> oh, we're so pleased with ourselves right now. And let's look at the gas line. Okay, so it's, some is making it down below. Perfect. It's a little bit of a drip feed happening if things get to, uh, too tubular, dude. Gnarly. So I got three. There's four of them. I wonder if there's more over here. And this thing. What I want to do, because we're going to run out of water pretty quickly with this, and we're going to have to procure this water. Also, in the down below on the bottom, the petroleum level can get a lot of water in it, too. Or right, we need the water to get the petroleum out of the thingy. So, guys, that's going to wrap it up for today. If you enjoyed the video, let me know and keep your stick on the ice. We'll catch you next time.